in a strategic technical meeting with presidents of federations, Minister of Sports Development John Ino expresses his commitment in preparing Team Nigeria for the upcoming Paris 2024 Olympic Games and Paralympic Games held Thursday at the Moshuda Abiola National Stadium, Abuja. He emphasizes the importance of building on the success of Nigerians' performance to surpass its best Olympic record achieved at the Atlanta 1996 Games. He therefore highlights the need for early evaluation of any challenges that could potentially hinder Team Nigerians' performance. Giving an opportunity to our ministerial podium, you know, performance advisory committee to also provide some advice and suggestions as they keep engaging and also an opportunity to share with the various federations the various plans for training in country and training abroad and the various locations and the timelines. Meanwhile, the Nigerian Wrestling Federation has started a training camp in Yenegua, Bayelsa State Capital, in preparation for the upcoming Paris 2024 Olympics. The camp, which began on May 29, 2024, will feature a total of six athletes representing Nigeria in the wrestling event, including five females and one male. One of the athletes leading the team is Blessing Oborodudu, who won the silver medal at the Tokyo 2020 Olympics. It's a stronghold for Nigeria. Uh, we're going to the Olympics with a lot of optimism. Um, going with probably one of the biggest contingent to the Olympics ever. And uh, we're, we're, we're very hopeful that uh, things will turn around for good. The end of the 2023-2024 campaign is drawing even closer as Saturday's Champions League final will bring the curtain down and another entrilling season of European football. Borussia Dortmund and Real Madrid will both head to Wembley this weekend to chance their arm at the ultimate prize in club football with storylines on both sides, making this a seriously exciting prospect. And finally, reigning champion Novak Djokovic progressed towards securing his fourth French Open title by achieving a commanding victory of 6-4, 6-1, 6-2 over Roberto in the second round.